All right, good job, Rudy. All right, today we're out here at the island in Parody, Louisiana, and we're renewing an old tradition of hunting called a European tower pheasant hunt. Pheasant hunting was popular in Great Britain as far back as the 10th century, but it really became popular in Spain, where uh, the richer you were, the more land you had, the more birds you could shoot. What do you see as the biggest mistake when somebody comes out here and they're not hitting these birds? Shooting too early. Shooting too early is the biggest problem that I've seen. You gotta wait till the bird gets in range. A lot of people get excited, you know, birds coming to them, the, ex the excitement of the hunt, birds flying all over, and just getting too excited and shooting before it's in range. I'd have to say it's a lot harder than traditional upland hunting for pheasants. When your dog's on point, for me, I'm more focused on my dog and what she's doing, so when the bird flies, I kind of have a harder time, or an easier time getting it, I guess. Shooting them when they're, when they're like this is way different than what I'm used to, which is like this. It's not, not easy. You've got to lead them like any other bird. The only thing that's really different is you know there are going to be birds here. You still have to make the call. You still have to lead them and figure them out which way they're going to go and bring a lot of shells. You could come with your own group from 10 to 20 people, or we're running a special in February on Saturdays that you could just jump in with other people and make a hunt. It's real simple. Just give us a call and we'll set you up. You know, when our forefathers started these European tower hunts centuries ago, you got to wonder, did they have a clue that this was going to end up in a South Louisiana gumbo? I don't know. With the Fishing Game Report, Don Dubuque, Eyewitness News.